Hi, I'm Nick Boyer. For this experiment, we wanted to see what temperature pill bugs prefer, whether it be a colder temperature environment, a room temperature environment, or even a warmer temperature environment. For our hypothesis, we figured that the pill bugs were probably going to go for the, war the warmer temperature environment rather than the cold temperature or the room temperature environments. Our independent variable was the basic temperature of each uh, environment, whether it be cold, room temperature, or warm. We didn't have any specific set uh, temperature, we just uh, chilled one with ice, made one with warm water, and then had our typical uh, room temperature. Our dependent variable was how many pill bugs went to each side of the choice chamber in each different environment. Our control was basically the room temperature environment. In our experiment, we had one side that was cold, one side that was room temperature. Then we did a separate experiment where one side was hot and one side was room temperature. We always compared it to the room temperature environment. For the materials, all we really needed were the choice chamber, the pill bugs, the ice and water, the warm water, and the two petri dishes. Well, we only had a few constants in this experiment, um, one of them being, of course, the pill bugs. We didn't change up the pill bugs at all. And um, also, for each petri dish, um, when we held up the choice chamber, we had the same volume of water in each one of them, just to ensure that it was constantly balanced and that we didn't have more hot or more cold in any uh, particular experiment. For our procedure, we took one petri dish and put some ice in it. Then we filled it to the top with water and made ice water, basically. Then we took half of the choice chamber and we set half of it into the ice water. Then we took an empty petri dish and put it under the other side of the other half of the um, choice chamber to level it out. Then we started putting, then we tried to put five pill bugs on each side of the choice chamber to observe what they did. Unfortunately, um, right as we were putting pill bugs onto the room temperature side of the choice chamber, they immediately ran over to the colder side of the choice chamber. So, whatever. For the second half of our experiment, we basically had the same setup, except instead of ice water, we had um, warmer water um, on one side, and then just a regular empty petri dish on the other side, and we observed what the pill bugs did from there. And this is basically what happened. Let's just do this. Sure. <laughs> oh, one just already... And now, yeah, they're all going over to cool. This guy's stuck upside down. Should we help okay. him out? Nope. And they're all over to the cold side. Weird, dude. I would not have expected that. I thought they'd be like. I would have thought they would have wanted the warm bed more. I mean, they're piling up on the. They're if trying you, to get out. If you look at it, the cold side actually has water, and they're eat, they're drinking the water. It looks like. Wait, shouldn't we like put the lids on these things? Because the cold side gets condensation. Cold in. Yeah. Hey, time's up. Time's up. And to analyze, they're all basically over. <laughs> that one just ran back over. They're all on the cold side except one. Hmm. Who's dead? <laughs> Oh, what's going on? I don't he think he likes warm this. water. No like spasm. He's like, oh crap, this sucks. Go back. As we were, as we observed, it seemed that the pill bugs kind of constantly were on the move, going back and forth between both sides. Um, majority of them stayed over on the colder side for the most part. Um, some of them did go back over to the warmer room temperature side. Um, but overall, by the end, they were pretty much all on the cold side. In our second experiment, um, they still kind of stayed over on the room temperature side, even though that side um, may not have been warmed up to room temperature. Um, it still may have been a little cold, so they kind of just stayed on that side and didn't go back over to the other side. From these qualitative observations, we were able to basically say that uh, our hypothesis was not supported based on what we saw. It turns out that the pill bugs mainly wanted to stay on the colder side of the choice chamber rather than the room temperature or even the warmer side. And this is possibly because the colder side actually con uh, condensated the air on the inside of the chamber. 
and caused um, basically a little layer of moisture on the inside of the choice chamber. Um, and I think the pill bugs were probably attracted to the moisture rather than the cold. Um, it just happened to be a coincidence. If, if we could have done it differently, we would have tried to attempt to get rid of any moisture on one side. Oh, and um, before I forget, Mr. Trap wanted to be in our video, so here's Mr. Trap. Can I be in the video? Yeah. Sure. Great video. <laughs> Great video. Back to the project. <laughs> they like cold.